hi everyone welcome back to my channel if you're new on this channel i'm Anne ain poachin i'm an author and i also do business today i just want to do a quick um conversation with you in the part of my channel that is called real talks so i'm gonna try and do vlogging as you guys know i've been trying to switch up a little bit rather than just having a sit down talk with you guys i will uh do a quick vlog so i've just dropped my son at nursery let's adjust this yeah i've just dropped my son at nursery and um making my way home and uh, so i thought let me do a quick vlog and then catch up with you guys a little bit Today is really, really hot, and uh, and so I haven't worn any makeup on because I just, I just, just will. I'll just be wiping it, wiping my face because it's so hot. And um, in the UK, it gets humid when it's hot, but today at least it's got a little bit of breeze, so it's not that bad here. So I hope you're all doing well thank you so much for those of you who have subscribed to my channel if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe and click the notification bell to let you know when i've uploaded a new video now today uh today's vlog is all about uh the transformation of hollywood that is what it's called so um so yeah i'm just gonna go walk with you guys a little bit and then find a sitting spot and I'll sit down have a sitting spot I'm, I'm pushing my my son's pram because they don't have a, a suitable storage space for me to leave it at nursery so people always look at me and they're like where is he? I'm like he's at nursery so if you see me with a pram empty pram it means i'm either going to pick him up or i've just dropped him off at nursery and uh, so yeah Ooh uh, okay let me we're nearly there where i'm going <laughs> you all right uh, we're nearly there. People look at you strange when you've got a phone and you're talking with a handheld device. But I, uh, um, because they're not really used to seeing vloggers, so they look at you like you're strange. That is the more reason why I even want to get used to vlogging. So that you guys can see so basically my son my son's nursery is just a little bit after town and uh, so I'm gonna go through town center so if you guys want to see like if you want to see what Rushton looks like put it in the comment section below and I'll do a vlog. I'm planning on doing a shopping vlog. So, um, if you'd like to see that shopping vlog, to see what shops are available in Rushton, uh, do put a comment in the comment section and I'll do a video. I'll do a vlog. But like, on that side of the roads there, um, is the library and the library has been opened so you can now go and do and use the what's it called you can now go and get some books from there and also use the computer So yeah, so then, uh, 
over there is Lido. Over there. That big store there is Lido. So that's where you get all the, like the reasonable products. The like it's a food store, but they also sell clothes. No, they don't sell clothes. Sometimes they do. Sometimes they sell like pajamas and stuff like that. But they more sell um food items and then gardening stuff. So yeah. So that is little. And then I'm just waiting for the road. You can see like the busy road. I'm just waiting to go. Okay. So I'm nearly there. So yeah, this dress, that's my outfit of the day, outfit of the day. I got this dress, it's a, pep it's a peplum dress. I got it from, um, I think it was FNF, uh, Tesco, I think it was. If not, yeah, I think it was. It definitely was FNF, but yeah. I really really like it it's very spacious and comfortable and very light so yeah so yeah let's get into the video of today um, basically I just wanted to share with you guys you know today's video is about the transformation of Hollywood now Hollywood as an industry as an arts and perf perf um, arts and entertainment industry it is you know the people they only care about your talent they only care about what you're good at like as an actor or as a singer that's all they care about really they just care about your talent and they care about your ability to basically um basically deliver you know when you when there's a movie out when there's a movie to be done and all of that that is what Hollywood cares about they don't really care about the other aspect of you as an individual and so I remember that when um, some of you may know the man who acted Miss Mrs. Doubtfire uh, Robin Robin Williams not Robin Williams Robin Williams the actor when he died yeah when he died um, God just began to lay this burden on my heart for for actors, you know, and actresses, and um, and that's when I saw this vision. In this vision, I saw like a group of people, basically the church and people within Hollywood, and the church left their position and went into Hollywood, and like the people within Hollywood, the, all these actors, like Cuban Gooding was there, Cuba, Cuba, um, Cuba Gooding Jr was there and you know they were just pouring out their heart like there was this particular girl um she was like saying how she's stressed and how her family they're just like upset and all the time they're just stressed out and angry and all of this and she was going through like a lot of things and you know and all these other actors they were saying issues that was um disturbing them at home their personal issues and they were just discussing talking to me and I was just like listening and listening to them and I was like okay and then I began to give them like the solution to the issues that they were facing and so we see that you know although these actors they're very talented and actresses <laughs> yeah um, they're very talented and stuff like that but they have a lot of dysfunction they have a lot of dysfunction in their own personal lives. That's why you see like their marriages fall apart. 
um, you see them having drug issues in and out of rehabs and stuff like that because they don't really have anybody to um, to really talk to as such and talk about the issues that they're dealing with so most of them find their comfort so to speak in alcohol um, and a lot of them find you know their comfort if not in alcohol they find it in drugs they abuse drugs and all of that stuff because you know because people don't really care about them and so if you're in that situation if you're an actor or an actress you know and you're in that situation where you're in the limelight you know find people that are not that are, who are not starstruck you know people who are not just bothered about your talent um who are not just bothered about your 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 stardom your money people who are not just bothered about those things those external attributes of who you are but find people who are genuinely like you know who can you can talk to you know people who can um, besides counselors besides psych psychiatrists besides um yeah besides those like professionals find people within your environment you know find a support system where you can talk and be yourself and say you know what i'm going through this i'm going through that you know my marriage is like this my children are like this you know can you help me to overcome this because until you find until you find that space where you can like really um really talk and say what is disturbing you within yourself apart from your work guess what you bottle up and bottle up and bottle up and before you know it you end up exploding you see that is why a lot of them end up committing suicide and so um because the thing is suicide is not just a spiritual issue but it's also sometimes because people see it as a way out people see it as a way out of their torment out of the issue the bigger issues that they're going through you know out of the pain that they're going through over and over again so so that's what i'll say to you like find find a support system that you can talk where you can talk where you can be yourself where you can you know say what is disturbing you and you can deal with it and you can overcome it in that way because alcohol is not going to help you drugs is not going to help you it only numbs the pain for a little t um a little while but then when you become sober guess what the pain will still be there the the abuse if you're in an abusive relationship the abuse will still be there if you are in a stressful environment the stressful environment will still be there so find someone, find people, find support groups where you can talk, you know, and um, where you can receive, I just dropped my money. stuff online so that is the library I'm gonna wrap this vlog up in a minute I just want to show you guys the Rushden Town Centre so this is the first I'm just about to get into the so this is the first town no this is the second town centre low when somebody's wearing something similar to you look Um, so there's a cafe there this cafe here 
I really, really like. So that's a cafe, this one here. So I really, really like English cafes. <laughs> I've never been into this cafe before, but I'd love to go in there. I'm gonna go in there one of these days. Sorry, hi. So yeah, so as you can see on this side, it's all shops. And then on this side as well, it's all shops. So I'm in the town centre now. <laughs> you alright? How are you? How are I? I'm fine, thank you. You see people avoiding my camera. Uh, so yeah, there's shops on both sides. There's a children's a children's hairdresser there just there opposite where I'm pointing the purple building it's a children's barber shop and then and then that is the florist Rushton Town Centre. This is it. So which where do you want to go? Is it a shop that you want to go to? No, this is a psychiatric uh, unit. Oh, psychiatric, psychiatric unit yeah. to uh, something to do with mental health. Yeah. The mental health yeah. clinic. Okay, let me show you. Don't don't worry, I'm not gonna put you on my camera. <laughs> Let me pause. Guys, give me a minute. So yeah, I just had to um, quickly show a, a young lady around to go to the psychiatric uh, center to deal with mental health. So yeah. Um, so as I was saying, that purple building there on the other side that is the children's hairdresser it's so cute and then next to it is the adults one and then again next to it again is the florist and then you have boots so that is where I get the products that I've been doing the reviews on. There, the boots. So yeah, they've got some really nice products. So it's a it's a drugstore, as they would call it. And so, and then let me show you one of my favorite stores. Yeah. And then this is one of my favorite stores. One of my favorite stores is Peacock. It's called Peacock. It's one of my favorite stores. Ooh, they've got a sales on. Sorry. Ooh, let me see. I am currently loving black colors like this. I'm actually looking for a. Sh oh, there's.
I'm looking for some sandals actually and they've got some thirty percent off. These are the times that I like to do my shopping. You know, you've got oh these these heels are nice. They just I'm looking for sandals because my sandals they've seen better days. <gasps> my sandals have seen better days. Oh I'll come and pick up a few. I didn't bring my purse today. So I'll come and pick up a few items. I only pick up the ones where they have sales, where they're on um, the prices are cut down. This is a nice pair of shorts, but I'd have to wear it at the beach or something. So anyway. Anyway, anyway, I really wanted this dress. Uh, but it's not on sale, so I would have to wait. I would have to wait. Well, anyway guys that is um that is peacock so that is one of the popular shops it's got children's clothes as well as as men's clothes and women's clothes and so i'm gonna wrap the vlog up here so guys remember like if you are in that position you know as an actor actress and you're going through like stressful issues in your personal life find someone find people who are not starstruck people who are not just bothered about your talent and your celebrity status but people who really like care for you care about you the individual the person and talk to them and see how you can best get help you know with the issues that you are facing and so yeah i shall leave you guys here i shall see you in the next video have a great day bye mm.